Start at verse 3. This is book of Zechariah, chapter 13 and verse 3. Yeah. And it shall come to pass that when all shall, when, second, that any yet shall prophesy when his father and his mother begot him, shall say unto him, Thou shalt not live, for thou spreadest life. So you see that, man? Our people, that's how wicked they are, man. They're coming up against the children of Israel, prophesying to our people the true doctrine of the Most High. Bring it again from the top, man. This is book of Zechariah, chapter 13 and verse 3. Yeah. And it shall come to pass that when any shall yet prophesy, then his father and his mother that begat him shall say unto him, Thou, hast not, thou shalt not live. For thou speakest lies in the name of the Lord. Right. That's these wicked people, sister. That's these Christian churches. When we come out here and we speak and we tell our people that we are the greatest people on earth. Right. And God is going to set us up back over these nations. Right. And we're going to have these nations on our neck. Right. The Arab man, we're going to be stomping him and uh, breaking his back. Right. Filthy beast. Right. These people castrated millions of our people, man. Right. In the sub-Sahara slave trade. Right. In the sub-Sahara slave trade, these Arabs, they did many atrocity against our people. Right. Read that. And his father and his mother that begot him shall thrust him through. When shall what? And his mother and his father that begot him shall thrust him through when he prophesied. See that? When he prophesied, his own father and mother shall thrust him through. Right. Shall stab him, man. Read that. And it shall come to pass in that day that the prophets shall be ashamed every one of his visions of his vision when he had prophesied neither shall they swear neither shall they wear a rough garment to deceive say that the prophets man they're gonna be shaking in their boots because our own people are going to be coming up against us to kill us, man, for this work, man. That's why we come out here boldly as a lion. Get me Matthew 5 and verse 12. Read up. But he shall say, I am no prophet. I am an husband man. See that? They're going to say, I am no prophet. I am a farmer. I am a husband man, a farmer. <laughs> Read. For man taught me to keep cattle from my youth. See that? That's all these wicked people, man. Our own people, that's how they was killing the prophets, man. Back in the days, man. And it's coming back. But we're not, we're not afraid. We don't come out here shaking in our boots. We come out here bold as lion, man. We speak the word of the Most High. You got that? Matthew 5 and verse 12. Matthew chapter 5 and verse 12. Bring it out. Rejoice and be exceedingly glad. Rejoice, man. Rejoice, because we're doing a great work out here, man. Read. For great is your reward in heaven. For so persecuted they the prophet which were before you. Yes, man, the same way they used to persecute the prophets, man. Filthy people come up and want to be bootlickers for the enemies, man. Right. Bootlickers for the enemy. They want to come up here and go up against our people. My brother, you know, according to the Bible, you know that our people is the children of Israel, the true people of the Bible. And we come out here to speak boldly because we know who we are. We are not Negroes. We are not black. You understand? Because when you look up the word black, everything that is negative is associated to it. That's why they tell us you are black man. You understand? Because we are walking around calling ourselves everything negative. You understand? And when they call themselves white, they're calling themselves pure. When they are not white, they are red. Red devils. You got something mighty, brother? Bring it up. It's book of Isaiah, chapter 13 and verse 14. And it shall be as the chase row, and as a sheep that no man take it up. They shall every man turn to his own people and flee everyone into his own land. Everyone that is found shall be thrust through. Everyone that is what? Everyone, Everyone that, that is found shall be thrust through. This is race war coming in the Bible, man. Right. I want you to bring it again. Because these people, they don't understand what's coming up in them, man. They want to be bootlickers for Isa. Right. And when the true judgment is coming up on the earth, they better not be found around Isa. Because Isa is going to kill them. God. These Arabs, they're going to kill them. God. These Indians, they're going to kill them. God. 
These Africans, filthy people, they're going to be killing our people again, man. Sister, hello? See that? Read what you got that. Isaiah chapter 13 and verse 14. Bring it out. And it shall be as the chase robe, and as a sheep that no man take it up. Say that. All our people, man, who are lost in Islam, kissing the, the dirty stone, God. the filthy stone, and saying, oh, Allah is inside of it. But now they want to say to us that, no, 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 Allah is not, Allah is everywhere. Like we're fools. Their doctrine from the beginning was that the stone was from God. And their God dwell inside the stone. So they worship that black stone. And now they want to come out and say, oh no, it's the direction. It's the direction that we face. Then if you're in Mecca, why are you spin, just still spinning around the stone and kissing the stone? Why are you kissing the stone and, and going around the stone? It can't be about direction. Because you're in Mecca, you reach the place. You reach the place, so why is it still about direction? Madness, man. Read up. They shall every man turn to his own people and flee everyone into his own land. Shall turn to his own what? Everyone shall turn to his own people. Yes, man, we love that. We love that. Because God is a racist, man. And you know what? We are racist. God. Because if I see two people drowning, and I see a Chinese and an Israelite drowning, it's, it's not a hard decision, man. Right. It's not a hard decision that filthy beast is going to die. Right. Same thing for all of these nations, man. God. If I see an Arab man drowning, I might put him, my foot on him and send him down further, man. God. And save my people. God. Yes, man. Now come out here with that effeminate bootlicking spirit, man. That's in these Christian churches. These devils, man. That deceive many of our people. Read them. Verse 15. Everyone that is found shall be thrust through. And everyone that is joined unto them shall fall by the sword. Yes, man. And we're going to be rejoicing, you know, because a lot of our people, they're wicked as hell. They're right. wicked as hell, man. Right. How can you not love the idea when I say to you that, when the most I say to you, that your people, our people, we're going to be ruling all of these nations. Our people have a problem with that. Stockholm Syndrome, man. Stockholm Syndrome. That's when the abused people feel sorry for their abusers. Right. That's like when a pimp, of a, 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 a woman pimping out, Beating her on our socks. And she said, oh no, but I love him. Israel is foolish, man. Madness. I'm effeminate, man. Man, when you see big man coming out here telling you that, oh, no, I, I love him. I forgive him. Your ancestors, your grandfather, see? They was being killed by these people for no reason. They were turning in their grave to see you come out a boot licking nigger, man. That's a right. Nigger. That's right. Sucking up to these people, man. Say, oh, I forgive them. I love them. I love them. God is love. John 3, 16. Not this man. Sister, according to the Bible, you know, our people are the chosen people. The children of Israel. You understand? Okay, my sister, that's mighty for you to know. But now you have to start searching the commandments and keep the commandments. All right, my sister? Beautiful. Who can give the sister a flyer? Give the sister a hand as well. Give the sister a flyer. Mighty, mighty thing we're out here doing, man. We know what we're out here doing. The raising up the tents of Jacob, man. Hold on, sister. We're getting you a flyer. We're getting you a flyer. Because we're out here for you, you know, sister. We come out here for our people. We don't come out here to speak with the nations. Because they're filthy as hell. And the most is going to bring them down. You understand, my sister? Yes, my sister. It's beautiful. Beautiful. Give the sister a hand again. Right. Give the sister a hand. Mighty. Yes, man. This is what we come out here to do. To raise up the tribes of, 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 of Jacob, man. Right. Yeah, man. All right, my sister. As I say, search the commandments and find out what you should be doing and not should be doing. Oh, beautiful. 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 Come here, Sharala. Come here, Sharala. Yes. Yes, man. Our work is being done, you know, man. Even though a lot of our people, there are some bootlickers, man. Especially the men. It's more disheartening when you see a man walking around telling you, oh, the people that he's supposed to be protecting, his children and his family, a great atrocity was done unto them. The greatest atrocity of the whole world. 
And they want to come out there and say, oh no, forgive them. That's right. Why nobody telling the, uh, the Jewish man to forgive them, the, uh, the Nazis? That's right. And forget about the Holocaust. Forget it. Stop talking about it. And every minute you turn, these people talking about Holocaust. Every See? Day. But they don't want to hear about slavery. My brother, you Hispanic? You Hispanic? You know, according to the Bible. My brother, listen up. According to the Bible, your people make up the 12 tribes of the children of Israel. That's right. Well, you understand, my brother? According to the Bible, you're an Israelite. Yeah, cousin. You understand? You, you know, you reject the most high. Okay, that's it. That's Israel, man. That's Israel. That's our people. Wicked as hell, man. Right. Wicked as hell. We want to boot lick, man. Lick the white man boots all day long. Right. You understand? We don't want to hear that we are the chosen people. Right. Tell somebody else that they are the chosen people. We don't want that. We don't want that, man. Priest. You got something? Uh, uh, the Good News Translation. Read it out. Isaiah. Isaiah chapter 30, starting at verse 8 in the Good News Translation. It says... It's lucky. It says, God told me to write down in a book what the people are like, so that there would be a permanent record of how evil they are. They are always rebelling against God, always lying, always refusing to listen to the Lord's teachings. The children of Israel, man. Read. They tell the prophets to keep quiet. They say, don't talk to us about what's right. <laughs> tell us what we want to hear. That's Let us it, keep man. our illusions. Right. They want to hear smooth things, man. Right. Filthy, 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 man. Yeah. Wicked men of Israel, man. Right. Get out, get out of our way and stop blocking our path. We don't want to hear about your holy God of Israel. That's the same. These people are the same today, man. Right. These people are the same today. They don't want to hear about the word of the Most High. You understand? They want to hear about all these filthy things about them and the heathens getting up together. Them and the heathens going in our kingdom. Who will be ruling? Because Esau is not going to give up power. See that? Right. Our people are comfortable being under the neck of these devils. Right. We don't see ourselves rising up and, 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 and getting out of the condition that we are. Israel is comfortable as a slave. Right. You got that, Dan? Right. Bring it out. This is the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 3 and verse 15. Yeah. That which has been is now, and that which has already been, and God required that which has passed. No, no, no. That, 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 that gone long time. And God requires that which is past. No, but we'll forget them. And God requires that which is past. No, but we're all humans. And God requires that which is past. God requires that which is past, man. That's right. So a man is going to reap what he sow. Right. So God is going to judge these wicked devils for the slavery, man. That's right. Get me Isaiah 14 and, and, and start at verse 1, man. Because our people they don't like to hear these things, man. Isaiah, chapter 14, verse 1. Bring it out, bring it out. For the Lord will have mercy on Jacob, and will yet choose Israel. And will yet what? And, and will yet, yet choose Israel. Israel. The Most High is still going to choose our people, sister. According to the Bible, we are the children of Israel. Come. You understand? We are God's chosen people. Come. Listen up, read. And will set them in their own land. The Most High is going to set us back in our own land. Read. And the strangers shall be joined with them. And the what? And, and the strangers, strangers shall, shall be joined, joined with them. them. The strangers shall be joined with us. Read. And they shall cleave to the house of Israel, uh, the house of Jacob. These strangers, they're gonna cleave to the house of Jacob. God. Read. And the people shall take them and bring them to their place. And, and the, the people shall take them and bring these filthy people to their places. Right. Read. And the house of Israel shall possess them in the land of the Lord for servants and handmaids. And the house of Israel, our people, going to possess these people for what? For servants, servants and, and handmaids. handmaids. That's it, Esau. Right. That's it, Esau. We're going to possess you okay. for servants and handmaids. Read. And they shall take them captives whose captives they were. We're going to take you captives because right now we are still your captives. Right. Bring that part again. And they shall take them captives whose captives they were. And they shall take them captives whose captives they were. Read. And they shall rule over their oppressors. And they shall what? And they, and they shall, shall rule over, over their oppressors. oppressors. Sister, this is the Bible. This is the King James Bible that we're reading out of. Your wicked pastor won't read these scriptures to you. According to the Bible, you are an Israelite. Right. And you need to repent and come back to the Most High. Right. As a daughter of Zion. Right. Not as a Christian. Come. 
Not as a Christian, your own salvation Wake is not up. for Christianity. Right. You understand? Read. Bless That's it, Anna. Bring out what you got up. You have precept? Bring it out. Bring it out, my dear brother. Book of Galatians 6, verse 7. Be not deceived. God is not mocked. Right. Whatever a man sow, that shall he reap. Yeah, but wicked pastor wanna come up here and say he's forgiven. Right. You understand? When the choice is not up to him. Right. You understand? The most high is gonna give a man what he reap. What he saw. What he saw. Right. You understand? He's gonna reap it. Right. And these filthy devils, no matter how much our people wanna be boot licking and come up here, no but I forgive them. But I I I I I I, I I'm okay with it. Well, we and them are friends now. Imagine, man. <laughs> or, they used to have fountains, water fountains here in this wicked place. And it used to say white only. And our people couldn't go there and drink the water. Because it said white only. You understand? These people, they segregate themselves from us. And now that they say, okay, you niggas can come and play with us. Okay, thank you, Isa. Thank you. You're so kind. Ah, you're my best friend. What's wrong with our people? It's feminine. It's feminine, man. Oh. Bring up, bring up what you got, my mighty brother. This is the book of Matthew, chapter 10 and verse 33. No. But whosoever shall deny me before men, him will I also deny before my Father, which is in heaven. You see that? Whoever denied the most high man, the most high is gonna deny them, man. Right. Because our people are wicked as hell, man. Right. Get me John 15 and 17. Right. Tell what you got, huh? Second Thessalonians chapter John 15, 1, verse 6. Seeing it is a righteous thing with God to recompense tribulation to them that trouble you. No, it is a wicked thing. Seeing it is a righteous thing with God to recompense tribulation to them that trouble you. You hear that? So the Moses I said this thing is a righteous thing. First to deal with Esau, very wicked man. Right. Bring out what you got up. Second Ezra chapter 15, verse 56. Like as thou hast done unto my chosen, says the Lord, even so shall God do unto thee. Even what? Even so shall God do unto thee. Yeah man, so we're gonna, the Moses is gonna be killing these wicked piglets, man. Right. These damn piglets, man, these hairy red people, man, these Caucasians, coming out of the caves and telling people they want to teach them to be civilized. What kind of madness is this, man? Go on. These people were the last people to be taught civilization. Go on. All nations were civilized before them, even the filthy Arabs, man. Go on. And shall deliver thee into mischief. Thy children shall die of hunger. That what? Thy children, children shall die of hunger. Yeah, we see that going on today. We see that going on today because these filthy heathens, man, all of them going to face the wrath of the most high, man. Right. We know. And thou shalt fail through the sword. Thou shalt what? Thou shalt fail through the sword. Yes, man, the sword is going to pierce you devils, man. Right. Thy city shall be broken down and all and all thy shall perish. Shall what? Perish. Shall perish. perish. With the sword in the field. They that be in the mountain shall die of oh. hunger and eat their whole flesh. And what? And, and eat their, their whole flesh. flesh. That's coming to you, wicked devils, man. Right. That's and drink. Read, read, read up. And drink their own blood. They, I think they're gonna be loving the, that part because these people filthy as hell, man. They, they're doing it even right now without um, without nobody forcing them. Right. These devils sacrificing babies, eating flesh and drinking blood. We know these things, man. Read up. For very hunger and bread and thirst of water. Yes, the only difference is in those in these times to come, right. you're gonna be doing it for hunger and right. for thirst. But we know that your people doing these things right now at will, man. Listen, bring out, um, get me second Ezra. 15 and 46. Uh, we well, show something that. Bring out what you got, mighty brother. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 49 and verse 26. Bring it out. And I will feed them that oppress thee with their own flesh. And I will what? 
and I will feed them that oppress thee with their own flesh. Yes, man, these devils, man. Most I got it, got it for them, man. So even though in our in our sense we might say no, all right, let's uh, let me stop here. No, the most I'm gonna say carry on, right. carry on. Right. Even these people, wicked man, Call. because they are wicked. Call. Yes, man, they go the piglet, man. You think you get a good man? Here goes the piglets. Bring up. And they shall be drunken with their own blood. These people are gonna be drunken with their own blood, man. Right. Get me the James uh, um, um, the, the, the John 15 and 17. Right. And you got the second as well. Hold on. John chapter 15 and verse 17. Bring it up. These things I command you that you love one another. Right. That you what? That you love one another. We should be loving one another, man. Read up. If the world hate you, he know that it hated me before it hated you. So why these Christian pastors, these bootlicking pastors, want to suck up to the white man? House Negroes want to come up here and tell us how oh, Christ was loved and Christ is still loved. Christ said he was hated. Right. He was hated by all these filthy devils, man. Sister. Right. By all these wicked people, man. Give me that. Give me that up. Uh, second Ezra. Yeah, give me. Second Ezra. 46. Second Ezra chapter 15, verse 46. And it's like it. And and th thou Asia, thou, thou, art partaker. thou Asia. So the most size dropping dropping bombs. See? And who? And thou Asia, that art partaker of the hope of Babylon, and art the glory of her person. Woe be unto thee. See that? Whoa! Destruction is coming, O Asia. Right. Because we know you're partakers of Babylon right. and you want to mingle yourself with Babylon. You want to be like the Babylon. Right. You understand? You want to be like these filthy beasts, man. That's right. These Caucasians. Right. We know these Haitians, man. We know. Woe be unto thee, thou wretch, because thou hast made thyself like unto her and hast decked thy daughters in whoredom. Yes. That they might please and glory in thy lovers. Yes, because we know these, these, these Asians, man. They're trying very hard to be like the, the, um, the Europeans. You understand? Decking themselves in harlotry. You understand? And promoting all kind of pornography. You think we don't know? The most I know. Read up. Which have always desired to commit whoredom with thee. Read. Thou hast followed her that is hated in all her works and inventions. Therefore, the, say of God. Sorry. Thou hears ya. You have followed these piglets. These Rough goat is Europeans that is hated by everybody. Read. Therefore, say of God, I will send plagues upon thee, widowhood. So, whoa, whoa, whoa. The most I say, he's going to send plagues upon Asia. Right. Read. Widowhood, poverty. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Widowhood, right now, the Japanese, they're begging people to come over there to come breed them up. Right. <laughs> you don't know. Check it out! Check it out! You don't know. The Japanese, their their population is going down very fast. Declining very fast. So they say right now we're giving them um, what they call it? Breeding breeding passport. Straight up. You can go and look it up. Breeding visa. To come over there and breed some breed, breed some, some Asians. They filled the dogs, man. So the most I say, what did the most I say? Wait, wait, wait. So, you gonna send plagues? I will send plagues upon thee. Widowhood. Widowhood. Poverty. Famine. Sword and pestilence. To waste thy houses with destruction and death. That's what the Most High is doing right now, man. Read. And the glory of thy power shall be dried up as a flower. The when glory the, of, the, of Asia, her power will be dried up. Read. When the heat shall arise that is sent over thee. When the what? The heat shall arise that is sent over thee. So see that man, the most I said is heat that is going around Asia right now. He is the one that sent it. Right. So these piglets talking about climate change, no such thing. We know who changed the climate. That's right. That's our power. That's right. That is our power. That's right. When in India recently, they had to close down the schools because it was too hot. That's right. The most I said, he is the one that sent the heat. That's right. 
You understand? So come out here. Hold me, man. Bring it out again, huh? Bring out the last part again. And the glory, so lucky, Second Ezra chapter 15, verse 50. I'll start fighting that again. I will send plagues upon thee, widowhood, poverty, famine, sword, and pestilence to waste thy houses with destruction and death. Hold on, hold on. So we see all of these things that is being talked about right now. It's going on right now. Right now it's going on. Because you can go and Google it, man. These Japanese, man, they're sending out breed, 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 breed visa. Invitation visa to come and breed them. Because the population is dwelling too fast. So the most I say is going to send widow. Read up. And the glory of thy power shall be dried up as a flower when the heat shall arise that is sent over thee. When the heat shall arise that is sent over thee. So the most I got, man, our power, man, Yahweh. Yes, man. He's the one doing all of these things. So when these scientists come, come about climate change, we don't know such thing happen, man. No such thing happen. We know these things, man. Who got some? Bring out what you got, my mighty brother. Revelations 18 and 21. And a mighty angel took up a millstone and cast it into the sea, saying, Death with violence shall the great city of Babylon be thrown down and shall be found no more. Oh. Yes, man. Great city of Babylon, man. That's talking about these Europeans. Uh, 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 um, the, um, you know, mainly about America. Right. But we know all of these Europeans, man. All of these Europeans, man. They, they, they're going to be cast down. Nowhere to be found, man. That's how we come out here in the spirit. Speaking boldly, man. We don't care about people and their feelings, man. Right. Get me Isaiah 51, 50, 58 and verse 1. What you got? Matthew chapter 25 and verse 31. Bring it out. When the Son of Man shall come in his glory and all the holy angels with him, then shall he set upon the throne of his glory, and before him shall be gathered all nations, and he shall separate them one from another, as the shepherd, the shepherd divided his sheep from right. the goats. Sister, the Moses is going to separate his nations. As a shepherd, divide the sheep from the goat. You understand, sister? These people are the rough goat. Yes, the Arabs, man. They are the rough goat as well, man. The Indians, they are part of the goats, man. You understand? So, bring out what you got, up. And he shall set the sheep on his right hand, but the goat on the left. Verse 41. Verse 41 Then shall he say also unto them on the left hand, The port from me, the what? The port from, from me, me. be cursed into everlasting fire, prepared for the devil and his angels. Yes, man. So these goats, they're going to be going into the fire. Right. Oh, you understand? My sister, I see you listening. According to the Bible, we are the children of Israel. You understand? The, the wicked pastors are not teaching us our true nationality. We are the people of the Bible. That's right. The true people. Slavery is in the Bible. That's right. All the atrocities that happen to our people That's is right. in the Bible. That's right. And we are the people. So we need to come back to the Most High with the knowledge of who we are and keeping His laws, statutes, and commandments. That's right. We are not black. You are not black women. That's the, they tell us that because everything negative is associated to it. That's right. Every, when you look at the word black, everything but is associated to it. And we come out here to speak boldly to make these nations know that we're going to have them in chain very soon. God. Because salvation is for the, the Jews. Jews. Right. And we are the Jews. Not these filthy people that is in Israel talking about they are Jewish. Right. They are dogs. That's right. right. That's the, the Bible. Sure. You understand that we come out here boldly as lions to bring out this truth to our people, man. To raise up our people. Sister, hold on. The mighty brother is bringing you a flyer. We have on um, our YouTube channel, The Rock of Your Arshai. Mighty brothers. Look at these brothers up here, man. There ain't no chicken up here. 
No chicken up here, man. Mighty, mighty brothers up here, man. Bring out what you got, my mighty brother. Isaiah chapter 30 and verse 20. And though the Lord give thee the bread of adversity and the water of affliction, yet shall not thy teachers be removed into a corner anymore. But that I shall see thy teachers. But thy what? But that I shall see thy teachers. My people, you are seeing your teachers, the children of Israel. You are seeing your teachers. There ain't no way any other nation can come and teach you the Bible. The only people that can teach you the Bible is your own people because the Bible was given to your own people. Right. Get me Psalms 147 and verse 9. The only people that can teach you the Bible is us. Your eyes shall see what? Your eye, yeah, uh, and I, but I shall see thy teachers, and thine ears shall hear a word behind me saying, This is the way, walk ye in it. This is the way, man, walk ye in it. Yeah, see that, man? Man, even, even, even the youngest of us, man, is mighty as hell, man. Right. Yeah, this brother read mighty. No fear. No little chick lets it up here, man. Be a mighty man, man. What you got, my mighty brother? Matthew chapter 20 and verse 25. But Jesus called them unto him and said, He know that the princes of the Gentiles exercise dominion over them, and they that are great exercise authority upon them. You see that, man? You know, in the end, man, we're going to be ruling these people in a nutshell, man. The most I say is going to break and shiver all nations, man. Sister, you know, according to the Bible, our people are the true Israelites, the Jews, that's us. All the atrocities that happen, slavery and all these things, it's recorded in the Bible. And these things, they happen to the children of Israel. You understand? My sister, according to the Bible, you're an Israelite. Search out the commandments and get back to them. Break that Psalms. This is, okay. this is Psalm. 147 and verse 19. He showed his word unto Jacob. He showed his word unto who? He showed his word unto Jacob. Sister, listen. The most I said, he showed his word unto Jacob. Jacob is the forefather of the children of the 12 tribes of the children of Israel. Read up. His statues and his judgment unto Israel. Listen up, sis. His statue and his judgment was only shown to the Israelites. Read. He had not done so with any nation. He had not what? He, he had, had not done so with any nation. The most High God did not deal with none of these nations, man. Get me Joel 2 and 27. Sister, listen. The most High did not deal with none of these nations. He had one particular people, which is the children of Israel. And those were the people that he loved and he dealt with. You got that? Joel. Joel. Listen up, sister. Joel, chapter 2 and verse 27. Read. And he shall know that I am the midst of Israel, so and that I am the Lord your God. So the most I say, what am? So the most I say, he's in the midst of Israel, and he's the Lord your God, and what? And, and none else. else. And what? And, and none else. else. These Christian churches, sister, they're not going to teach us these things. They're not teaching our our true nationality, our true. That's why in slavery they used to kill you if they found out you could read, because you're going to find out who you are. Oh. Are you going to find out that you are mighty people? Oh. Right. And there wouldn't be any more black and black crime. Oh. Because right now, our people say, All right, sister, you're an Israelite. Repent and come back to the Most High. Sister, there wouldn't be any more black and black crime. Because we, we would see value in each other. When I look at my brother and I say, Oh, he's a black man. And everything bad is, that is associated with black. There is no, no, no need not to kill him. Because there is no value in him. When I look at my brother and I say he's an Israelite, a prince of power. Right. 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 This man is a great man. Yeah. You understand? Sister, hold on. You finish up, bring it out. Uh, and my people shall never be ashamed. Sister, the Israelites, my brother, you're a mighty man. You know? You're an Israelite. Come back to the Mosai, keep him last touches and commandment. Sister, the Mosai people shall not be ashamed. You understand? Jump over to Amos. Sister, hear this one. Hear this one again. Uh, yeah, Amos 3. Listen up, listen up, sister. This is book of Amos chapter 3 and verse yes, 1. Yes, 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 sister. You can take it. Yes. Hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you, O children of Israel. So listen what, hold on. Listen what the most I said, sister. 
the Most High said, hear this word that the Most High spake against you, not against the whole world. Read. Against the whole family which I brought up from the land of Egypt. Against the whole family which he brought up from the land of Egypt. Read. Saying, you only have I known of all the families of the earth. Saying what? You, you only have I known of all the families of the earth. Why are these wicked bootlegging pastors not telling us these things, man? Right. Why are they not, not telling us our true nationality according to the Bible? God. They want to suck up to the white man every day. God. But we come out here as bold as lion, man. We don't care about these devils. God. They want to take away our job for, for doing this work. This is the work that we should supposed to be doing. Right. right. Bringing knowledge to our people, man. Raising up the tents of Israel. God. Right. Read it out, man. Therefore, I will punish you for all your iniquities. So the Most High God said, Ego, because we are the only people that he loved, we are, we are the only people he gave his commandments, he's going to punish us for our iniquities. Sister, if you have a child, and you see him playing outside with, with some other children, and they're doing all kind of folly, are you going to call everybody and beat them? No. You're going to call your child and beat them. That's right. That's what the Most High is doing unto us. That's right. right. Because we're disobedient unto him. That's right. You have something up? Read up. It's the book of 2 Samuel, chapter 7 and verse 23. And what one nation in the earth is like thy people? Sister, what nation in the earth is like our people? What nation can come, can come close to us? Everything we are the masters in it, man. My mighty brother. Take a flyer. Take a flyer, my brother. Give somebody give this, this mighty brother a flyer. My brother, according to the Bible, we are the children of Israel, God's chosen people. Right. And we need to come back and keep his commandments. No, this brother here. This brother. This brother here, man. Give him a flyer. Appreciate. Get the brother a flyer. You have something? Can I ask you a question? Yes, man. You can ask a question, man. What do you think that it, what Israel is doing to Palestine is a correct thing? You know what? It's correct because the Mosa is bringing out judgment on the Palestinians. Give me that. Give me that to the Mosa. I'm going to send a fire upon the wall of Gaza. Amen. You know these people? Amos. They were the people. Yeah, you got it? Amos. Amos. Listen up. Listen up. Listen up. Verse 6. Thus saith the Lord. Thus saith the Lord. For three transgressions of Gaza. And for four. I will not turn away the punishment thereof. No, I will have mercy upon them. I will not turn away the punishment thereof. God is speaking. God is speaking. Listen. Because they have carried away captive, the whole captivity to deliver them up to the east to Edom. Hold on, bring that back, bring back that thought, make sister get it. Read, read. This is the book of Amos, chapter 1 and verse 6. Thus saith the Lord, for three transgressions of Gaza, and for four, I will not turn away the punishment thereof. The most I say, he's not going to turn away the punishment. That's right. So we can't get into our feelings and say, oh, you know, sorry for the Gazans. That's right. No. So another word. Read, read. Listen, Therefore, because they carried away the captives, the old captivity, to deliver them up to Edom. Because they, yes, my brother, might give this brother on. Give this brother on. This brother know what's going on. Truth. That's what we come up here to speak. Truth. You understand? Hold on. Listen, listen, listen. The most. Well, but I will send a fire on the wall of Gaza, which shall devour the palaces thereof. Read. Yeah, but who wrote that? Who wrote that? And oh, yeah. I will cut off the inhabitants of Ashdod and him, him that hold the scepter Bible. from Ashkelon. And I will turn my anger, I will turn my hand against Ekron. And the remnant of Philistines shall be perished. And say, say the Lord God. Yes, the most I said, these people, they deliver up the children of Israel unto the Edomites, the red people, your people, the devil, the piglets. Yes, we come out here boldly to say it, man. Okay, go and speak. Let me listen to you. Let, let me tell you something. The yes. Reason, the reason that everything is happening is in Israel is the Israelis don't listen to anybody. Because they are devils. They are the Amalekites. They are not Israelis. We are the children of Israel. Correct. These people in the land calling themselves Israelis, they are the Amalekites. Filthy dogs. Yes. Yes. I, I, I agree with you. They are right. what they call Ashkenazis. God. You can't be Ashkenazi and be a Jew because Ashkenazis are Gentiles. That's right. right. You can't be two nations. So do you think 
what Israel is doing in Palestine is correct. We're doing business. The Most High ruling all kingdom of the earth. That's Everything right. that happened in the mo in the earth, God is the one that sanctioned it. That's get me, right. get me up. Uh, hold on, listen. Get me um, uh, um, Amos three and verse six. Listen, listen. Look at this. Amos three and verse six. Who got it? Who got it? We can't get in. We can't get in our feelings. Listen, what the Most High said. You got it, Amos. Amos chapter 3 and verse 6 shall a trumpet blown in the city and the people not be afraid shall a trumpet be blown in the city and the people not be afraid really shall there be evil in the city and the Lord has not done it shall what shall there be evil in the city and the Lord has not done it this is the God we serve we don't serve that Christianity God that they tell you oh God is love God loves everybody. You don't serve that God. Our God is mighty and he fights battles for the children of Israel. And whoever comes up against the children of Israel, he's going to take them down. That's right. The Palestinians, they're feeling for what they have done unto us. Come on. How about the children of Palestine? The children of Palestine? They're heathens, man. They're not our people. What do you mean? We're all God's children. Everybody. No, 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 no. No such thing. No such thing, man. This is the book of Isaiah chapter 45 and verse 7. I form the light. I create darkness. I make peace. I create evil. Hide the Lord do all these things. Hide the Lord do what? Hide the Lord do all these things. Yes, man. That's right, man. Hide the Lord do all these things. Get me do turn number 7 and 6. You got a precept? Bring it up. Bring it up. Bring it up. My, my, I bring out precept. Ecclesiastes chapter 3 verse 16. And moreover, I saw under the sun the place of judgment. The place of what? The, the place, place of, of judgment. judgment. Yes. Read. You've got to understand who wrote that. Who wrote that? The wickedness was there. Huh? And the place of righteousness, that iniquity was there. Okay, listen, we're going to prove it to you. You want to know who wrote this? Here's it, my brother. Psalm 68 and 11. Psalm. Psalm. Listen, listen. 68 and verse 11. The Lord gave the word. Who? The Lord gave the word. Who? Great was the company of those that published it. You see who read this? The Most High gave the word unto his prophets. You understand? And they are the ones who write down these things into a book. You understand? Get me, get me that, get me that in Revelation. Get me that in Revelation. Revelation 1 and um. Get me Revelation 1. The Lord gave the word. Yes, yes. What do you mean by the word that he gave? He gave them the understanding, the knowledge of what they're supposed to write down. A normal man couldn't write this book, man. Why, right. Why, why a normal man couldn't write, write this book? Because no man has the knowledge of his own to write a book like this, That's that deal with everything under the sun. That's right. You think you could write this book? No. How could you write this book, man? Because when you're going to put into it that two men should lie down with, with each other. That's right. You can't write this book, man. Your people are the people going around talk, talking about a man can go with a man and a woman can go with a man right. and a woman can go with a woman. Right. How could you people write the book? That's right. You are filthy people, man. That's right. Piglets. God. Read it. This is the book of Deuteronomy chapter 9 and verse 10. And the Lord delivered unto me. Well, what did you say? He said, we're not all the same. Oh, that's, give him a give round. Give him a hand. Give him a hand. Give him a hand. Give him a hand. That's right. That's right. That's right. Listen up. Listen up. This is book of Deuteronomy chapter 9 and verse 10. And the Lord delivered unto me two tables of stones written with the finger of God. Written with what? Written, written with, with the, the finger, finger of God. God. Yes. That's what we come out here to do. Prove all things. Get me first Thessalonians 5 and 21. You're doing what you believe. We're doing what we believe. Yes, and we are convicted in it because we know it to be the truth. Right. You Thessalonians. You people, you want to come? Like read what you got. Read what you got. First, second, first Thessalonians chapter 5 verse 21. Prove all things. Prove what? Prove, prove all, all things. things. That's what we do. So any topic you touch on, we're going to prove it from the Bible. Right. Don't say the Holy Bible. Don't say the Lord. Okay. You understand? Right. Read that. Read that. Read that. This is the book of First John chapter 3 and verse 10. In this the children of God are manifest and the children of the devil. Whosoever doeth not righteousness is not of God. Your people don't they don't do righteousness, man. So hold on, hold on. Let me let me ask you something. Let me ask you something. Okay? Have your people done righteousness on the earth? Have your people been judging the earth in righteousness? Yes, my people are I 
Irish people. I'm from oh. Ireland. We support you're still, you're still Isa, man. We support Palestine. You're, you're still Isa. Listen, 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 listen. Um, um, is what going on in Palestine? Is it more wicked than um, than slavery? Than the slavery that happened to our people? Yeah, but slavery wasn't. It was. No, hold on a second now. You see, I'm listening to you, which you're not listening to me. I'm listening, man. Okay. Slavery. The Irish were were taken as slaves out of Ireland. No, 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 no. No, they weren't. No, they weren't. The Irish were taken out. The Irish, their own slaves, man. No, we weren't. Listen, li listen up, listen up, listen up. This is the book of John 8, chapter 44. John 8, verse 44. No, you know what I'm saying? What do you say? What, what, I, didn't, I didn't hear that. No, I was telling you, he's a Jamaican brother. What does Jamaican mean? Jamaica what? is a country. No, no yes, it's a, it's, a, it's a country, yes. But what does it, what does it, uh, 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 Ireland, what, does, what is the meaning of the word Jamaican? You don't know. What? See, wood and water. So see, our people want to be stupid all the day long calling themselves wood and water. None of us up here is wood and water. We are Israelites, right. prince of power. That is what the most I call us. That's right. Prince of power. So what do you think? So all right. So you are Israelites. Hold on. Listen, listen to this first. Listen to it. We're going to get back to you. You, listen said, to you said your people judge the earth in righteousness. This is for you. John 8 and verse 44. Ye are of your father, the devil. The lust of your father you will do. He was a murderer from the beginning and abode not in the truth because there is no truth in because there's no truth in him. When he speaketh a lie, he speaketh of his own. For he's a liar and he's the father of it. Yes, your people. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Listen, listen up, listen up. Your people, you understand? Who, who you come up here and say, say you, you're defending Palestine, right? And, you, and um, you love Palestine and want to save Palestine. Who are the people that is killing the Palestinians? Is it your people? It's the Israelis. It's the Israelis. Who's supporting the Israelis? America. Oh, oh, right. Right. That's it, man. And America and Britain. So why you want to come up to us? We're speaking to our people that our people should rise up out of the dust because we're going to have all you nations in chains very soon. According to the Bible. See that? See that? Isa has been caught with that, man. Okay, let me hear you. what you got to say. America and yeah. England yeah. are the ones that support Israel. And Germany and France. No. All you people, man, the devils, man. No. And, and Germany and France. Yes. Well, they, they support Israel. Yes. They are arming them. Israel couldn't be doing what, he's do what they are doing without America, okay. Britain, Germany, France, and all these devils. So they believe in these children's dying, man. Right. So why you want to come up here and talk to us, man? We right. don't give a damn. Listen, you understand? Listen, listen. If, Go on. If somebody can't come up and talk to you, then what you're talking is wrong. Okay, then. You see that? You're getting your feelings, but we allow you to speak, man. Huh? <laughs> what? That's another boot licking nigger, man. That's another boot licking nigger, man. You want to kiss the white man butt all the day of your life, man. You want to come up against your people, man. And kiss the white man butt all the day of your life. Filthy beast, man. Uncle right. Tom. Bring out what you got. We're going to close out right now, anyway. Revelation chapter 13, verse 9. Read. Read. If any man have an ear, let him hear. Read. He that leadeth into captivity, captivity shall go into captivity. Read. He that killeth with the sword must be killed with the sword. No, maybe. Must be killed with the sword. We're having fun cutting these negro, these um, these Edens, man. Okay. These piglets, we have having fun doing it, man. Get me Proverbs 28 and 1. Let me just close up with that one. Here is the it, patience and the, the faith of the saints. The piglet, he cannot stand it, man. He cannot stand it. So he's going to look some of some, um, some our people to go and bring them further into, into, into deceiving them. Right. My sister, don't listen, don't listen to the devil. Don't listen to the devil. Hold on. Get, no, no, get me um, Get me Mark 4 and 11. Get me Mark 4 and 11. Sister, listen up. Listen up what's going on. Mark 4 and verse 11. Mark. Bring it up. Mark. Who got it? Mark chapter 4. Listen up, sister. Mark chapter 4 and verse 11. Yeah. And he said unto them, unto you, it is given to know the mystery of the kingdom of God. But unto them that are without, 
all these things are done in parables. Esther, it is given to you to know the mystery of the kingdom. And to these devils, they cannot understand it, man. Right. Read up, read. Verse 12. Thus seeing they may see and not perceive, and hearing they may hear and not understand. They can't understand what's going on in this Bible, sister. Read up. Lest at any time they should be converted and their sin should be forgiven them. They can't get salvation, sister. These people they can't get salvation. They are the wicked of the earth. Read up. And he said unto them, Know he not this parable? And how then will he know all parables? The sower soweth the word. Sister, the sower soweth the word. That's what we're out here doing. So in the word unto our people. That's right. right. Oh, read, read. And, and these are they by the wayside, where the, the word, word was sown. But when, when they, they heard, Satan cometh come immediately and, and take away the word that was sown in their heart. Sister, don't make Satan come and take away the word that was sown. <laughs> sister, laugh. sister, sister, laugh. sister, 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 and bring our people into a low state, sister. That's right. Now it's time for us to rise up. Right. Sister, that's that's it, my time. We're going to give a mighty hand to the most high. And we say, Barakataya Hawa, Barakataya Shai, Barakataya Hawa, Barakataya Shai. I'm Manuela, Shalom, Mighty people, man. Sister, that is of the devil. That is of the devil, man. That's 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 satanic. That's satanic. The Bible says you mustn't worship no idol. The Bible says you mustn't make no graven image. And so we know all people deceive, man. Because they said they follow in the Bible, and the Bible said no graven image, but they won't come up here with the cross. That's devil, man. Spirit. <laughs> <laughs>